Welcome to the sixth episode of Relax with Excel, where you may learn something about Excel, but will probably fall asleep. Then again, maybe you'll learn in your sleep. In this episode, we're going to cover the Flash Fill feature. The Flash Fill feature is a way to automatically fill in data based on a pattern or example. Here is a step-by-step -step approach on how to use the Flash Fill feature. Open the blank Excel file and enter some sample data in a column. For example, you can enter the following data in column A. The first row will be a header row. You can put a name in that cell. In the following rows, we'll have the name of people. The second row will be Alice Smith. Third row, Bob Jones. Fourth row, Charlie Brown. Fifth row, David Lee. Sixth row, Eve Green. Let's have column B show the names in a last name, comma, first name format. In cell B1, type the header field last, comma, first. Select the cell B2 and type the data you want to fill based on a pattern or example. For example, you can type Smith, comma, Alice in cell B2 to fill in the last name, first name, separated by a comma. Press enter to complete the data entry. You will see data in the cell. For example, you'll see Smith, comma, Alice in cell B2. Select the cell again and click on the Fill button in the Editing group on the Home tab. You will see a drop-down menu with different options to fill the data. Click on the Flash Fill option in the menu. You will see the data automatically filled in the adjacent column based on the pattern or example. So for example, you'll see the following data in column B. The header row will be last, comma, first, which you entered. The following rows will be Smith, comma, Alice, which you entered. The next row, row 3, will have the flash fill feature enabled. It will have Jones, comma, Bob. The row after that will have Brown, comma, Charlie. After that will have Lee, comma, David. And the last row will have Green, comma, Eve. You can copy and paste the data to other cells or modify the pattern or example to fill in different data. For example, you can type A period Smith in cell C2 and use the flash fill feature to fill in the first initial last name separated by a dot. Let's try with a keyboard shortcut now instead of using the ribbon command. After you type in A period Smith and press return, use the keyboard shortcut Control E and it will perform the flash fill. You will see the following data in column C. In cell C2, it will be A period Smith the way you typed it. In the next row will be B period Jones. The next row will have C period Brown. The row after that will have D period Lee. And the last row will have E period Green. That was the basic explanation of Flash Fill and how to use it in Excel. If you're still awake, thanks for getting this far. If you're asleep, pleasant dreams.